Jeez, you're so pathetic. CPUs shouldn't complain so easily. It's just us here, so it's fine, isn't it? Besides, I know your secret. When Noir gets into the bathtub, she gives off a big grumbling sigh like an old man. <sighs> what? Where did you hear something like that? From Uni. She told me all about it in exchange for a cosplay photo mag you secretly released. Why do you even have something like that? I thought I'd ask my friend to make only a limited run of 100 of those. <laughs> The world can be surprisingly small, Noir. I don't even want to think about it. But you don't have any more copies, do you? One for me, and one for backup, and three for distribution, so I still have lots left. She's not touching on the fact that Uni agreed to that transaction, huh? Hmm? What's wrong? I hope it's only my imagination. But is something coming towards us from over there? Over there? Yes, from way over there. I believe that's... <laughs> yes, it's a horde of monsters. And it's a huge amount. From looking at the direction they're moving, I predict they're most likely heading towards the exit. Which means we'll have to defend the way out no matter what. Indeed, if we allow such a mass of monsters through, game industry will descend into a panic. However, this amount might be a little too much for us to bear alone. Sorry, if I knew this was gonna happen, I would have brought Uni along. Nobody is blaming you. Besides, running into a horde of monsters like this was quite an unexpected development. And it is simple strategy to want to conserve your forces. That's about right, if you got it. Then hurry up and transform already. The enemy isn't gonna wait. You're right. I understand. Hey, what's going on, Neptune? You should transform. Wait, I think I know those monsters. What? What the hell do you mean you know them? Where did you meet them? What? Could it be... The Zero Dimension? It is the world that isn't this world, which you and Nepgear went to, yes? I'm checking just in case, but you aren't mistakenly seeing things, right? Nope. I'll bet my retro game collection on not being wrong. Then the end of this area must be connected to Zero Dimension. But why? We can think about that later. Right now, we gotta take care of these guys. Right! Then let's show off our strength to these zero-dimension losers! I'll face you with all of it my, is my power! Eat this! There Eat this! You're finished! <laughs> Looks like you were one step short of me. They've sure got the numbers. But they were no match for us. Although we're a mess as well. Now then, what should we do? Should we go on ahead, or should we head back? I'm curious to see how things are ahead. But first, we must report back at the Basilicom. Right. I can't imagine those were the only monsters. So we should work out a proper plan. But if there are other monsters, will it be safe to return? It was fine this time as we happened to find the advancing monsters, but if more appear while we're at the Basilicom... You're right, but we can't just divide our forces here. Then why don't we just block it up? Block it? Block it how? With what? Like this, of course. I'll just set this substance Nepgear confiscated because she said it was too dangerous right about... here. Ugh. All I have is a really bad feeling. Starting the countdown. Three, two, one, ignite! Ah! Goodness. 
To think you'd block the road with exploded parts of the wall. I didn't know you could destroy these walls. How's that? Now the monsters can't get through. Jeez, tell us first before you do something like that again. <laughs> Sorry. I didn't think it was going to have that much power either. Well, whatever. We were able to stop the monsters advancing, so let's hurry back to everyone. <sighs> it's quite troublesome if you do something like that, Nepsy. Huh? Th that voice. Could it be? Hey there, Nepsy. It's been a while. Osame! Why are you here? Is this place really connected to the zero dimension on the other side? Bingo. This corridor was created between the boundaries of Hyper and Zero Dimension, like a passageway between the two. Hey, Neptune. Do you know that girl? Yep, that's Uzume, the CPU of Zero Dimension I told you guys about. Wow, pretty crazy meeting in a place like this. Are you investigating too? Not really. I'm just the commander. Commander? But still, Nepsy. Defeating the monsters aside, you didn't have to go block the dimensional corridor, did you? It's all right. I got to run into Nepsy again and finally meet these other CPUs. What in goodness is this? Could this be that crazy thing Neptune said she fought in Zero Dimension? But why? Wasn't that girl fighting along Neptune to defeat this thing? Half right, half wrong. Hey, what is this all about? Why are you able to summon the giant, Uzume? That doesn't matter. Nothing matters anymore. After all, you and the others will be falling into a whirlpool of delusion from now on, Nepsy. Huh? Ah! Now, I've captured the currently active CPUs. I can't believe they'd be drawn out so easily without realizing it was a trap. Now then, I'll be heading back. I will soon make you fully complete, too. Uzume? Hmm? Is that you, Uzume? If it isn't Gearsy, long time no see. If I could, I'd love to have an enticing conversation about old times. But unfortunately, I hadn't called for you, Gearsy. I don't want you to get all beat to hell before the party starts. Let's meet again when the time comes. Please wait! Uzume! Neptune! Please let Neptune and the others go! Don't go, Nepgear! Don't stop me, Uni! Our sisters just got kidnapped! Don't you think I know that? Then don't stop me! We have to hurry and save them! Noir got taken away too, you know! We can't be wasting time here! We have to hurry and save them! You... Just calm down already, you idiot! Pull yourself together! This isn't like you! You... Me? I mean, of course I want to go save Noir! But this is exactly the time we need to calmly make decisions! And you saw that thing, that giant freak that captured our sisters, right? I know it's frustrating, but there's no way we'd stand a chance against it. We just gotta head back to the Basilicom, like now. I'm sure Eastwar will help us figure out what to do, okay? It's gonna be all right. Sorry for the wait, I was filing the report. <sighs> so, have you cooled your head a little? It's unreasonable. I stopped you and then I even gave a report in your place. And I'm the one that's getting scolded. But I understand how you feel. A little bit. Someone you fought together with suddenly abducts our sisters. And the giant you fought with is there too. Of course you'd get confused. I don't get any of it myself. Why? Why would Uzume? I don't understand at all. Please, help me, Uni. Then you'll just have to go and check yourself. And then we'll save our sisters. We already know what we have to do. But, but... Oh, jeez. How long are you gonna sit in here and mope like this? Rom, Ram, and I are all prepared to go save our sisters, so what? Are you just gonna stay in here crying about it? Get a 
freaking grip, Nepgear! I know. I want to go save Neptune too. But I can't fight Uzume. I have no idea what I should do. I'm really starting to get irritated now. All you need to be thinking about is saving Neptune like any good sister would do. I'll help you with Uzume in figuring out what to do about that situation. Don't worry. So, just try relying on me a little bit more, okay? Uni. Or maybe I'm not reliable enough. No, you're plenty reliable. In fact, I feel like the only person I can rely on at a time like this is you, Uni. Hey, wait a minute! I heard that! Rom, Riam, when did you get here? Good grief! We came here to pick you up since we finished preparing for saving our sisters! How rude! Netgear? Are Ram and I not reliable? N no, that's not true at all. Both you and Ram are just as reliable as Uni is. That's good. All right, well, let's wrap this up and head out. We're going to show them just how much our power as CPU candidates has grown. Let's head over to Eastwar. If you guys have finished preparations, I'm sure she's figured out where our sisters have been taken.